Hello friends, Sniz here, and today I'm going to try and showcase the A Thunderbreaker bug. There might be more. So in KMS, the skill Flash works is a first job skill, and it's a first job skill in GMS as well. But it works as an animation cancel, meaning if you're in the middle of attacking, you can press Flash to teleport or at least stop the animation and be able to move freely. One of the biggest complaints that most people who have played Thunderbreaker in a bossing scenario have is that it suffers dramatically from animation lock. There are ways around it, of course, but for the most part you are still locked. The, the most you can do is rush, which is title crash, and apparently title crash is another bug, but I don't know how to recreate it, so I'm not going to address that. But Flash is supposed to function as an animation cancel. It's a short teleport, and if there's an enemy in range, it'll teleport to that enemy and smack them for one line of damage. It does not currently have the animation cancel. I have a keyboard visualizer on screen to help showcase that, and I'll play a few clips later on, and maybe right now, of a KMS Thunderbreaker going through a mobbing rotation. And you can see that at certain points, He'll use flash after attacking, and it'll be quick. He'll attack, and he'll flash to the next mob. Here in GMS, you cannot use flash to animation cancel. If I were to attack, and then press my R key, which is my flash key, I have to wait until the animation finishes. An even better example is Tidal Crash. Tidal Crash is super long animation right now, and I should be able to but I have to wait till the animation finishes. And I'm holding the R key, you can see. You have to wait. Whereas in G KMS, that is no, not a thing. You you tap your title crash, you tap uh, flash, and you're, you're canceled. You're already over here before the title crash animation even finished. The whole point of like bringing this up and like why it's actually become a problem for me is I want to plan, I plan to start running Varicilla and Varicilla is a lot more finicky with with your positioning, so Tidal Crash is not as precise as a Flash Cancel is, because you can Flash and immediately move, whereas Tidal Crash you have to like wait to move. So you could be rushing into a string to avoid a... You could be trying to avoid a string, rush into another string, and still get a Red Skull, which is unfortunate. And I'll put a few links of... A bunch of other videos and you can see that there's one striker video or thunderbreaker video where he solos Varus Hilla and he's canceling his skills constantly to keep positioning correct so he doesn't get unnecessary red skulls. Uh, the more imminent to a new player is Golix. Golix in phase 2 has a, an attack where the arm will reach up and grab you. You're supposed to take the portal down but you're if you're in the middle of attacking, you're locked. You cannot do anything but iframe, and iframe's up every forty every forty five seconds. So that's not always available to you. You need to stop attacking and go through the portal. But if a flash cancel was available, you could flash to the other side to avoid the the hand, which isn't a possibility currently. Because by the time you f you get out of animation lock, you're dead. Green pot helps avoid it a bit, but it's still not super consistent. The best way to beat the eyes on Golix right now is just to attack every so often, like sparingly, and then once you know he's about to grab you, then you stop attacking and just wait for it. And that's really time consuming and annoying for new players that are struggling to get the damage in, especially with since Golix just recently got buffed. The original thought that the original reason people thought this bug was supposed to be here is because hard cap breaks it. But as you can see, I'm not at hard cap. I don't have a green pot popped, and I'm still unable to flash cancel. Like I am tapping my keys, and I'm holding down that R key, and you have to wait till the animation finishes for me to flash, which is not supposed to be a thing. On screen will be hopefully a clip of a KMS player doing what I want, an animation cancel. It's this this bug limits Thunderbreakers incredibly, and it's probably the biggest complaint anyone has about the class is in a bossing scenario, you do not have precise movement, and you don't have as much control as you would with other classes that can move. Because they're out of their animations much, much quicker than a Thunderbreaker is, especially when they're linking skills, because you have to wait for both animations to finish. 
The other bug that supposedly exists that I can't recreate is... I used to be able to recreate it, actually, in Spirit Savior, is if you tap your title crash key, which is D, and then you use another skill in midair, all other skill actions will be cancelled, and as soon as you touch the ground, title crash will proc. It seems that this update, or a past update, I don't know when, has fixed that, because I can, I can jump, hold D, and then I can still use another skill. I'm just going to interject right here. Uh, that's actually false. So what I was trying to do was trying to use the title crash first and then attack, which is not the issue. In from my limited understanding, so this might be incorrect, but it's still a bug. I can still create the bug. Tapping title crash and KMS while midair cancels the animation of the current action you're doing. So if you're jump casting Thunderbolt, like, and you tap Title Crash in midair, the you don't have this ending lag when you land. You don't. You just you can keep moving. In that's in KMS. In GMS, if you do that, if you're watching the visualizer, I'm tapping D very quickly, my Title Crash key, while I'm midair, and it's proccing as soon as I hit the ground. If I, I if I wanted to do it even better, watch the key visualizer. Yeah, I would hold it if you didn't catch that. What I did is I thunderbolted, tapped title crash, and then I held thunderbolt again. You cannot put in any skill inputs while the title crash is queued and waiting for you to hit the ground. So if you get stuck in midair for whatever, if you're hovering in midair doing whatever, and you tap the D key, you're stuck until you can't do anything. You can't you can't change directions as far as I'm aware. Yeah, you can't. You can go the other way, but like you don't switch directions. Like it just goes whatever direction you're of the arrow key you're holding when you land, or whichever way you're facing if you're not holding any arrow key. But so you can't put in any more skill inputs. So you can't. Yeah, like I, I was trying to ascension out of that so I could like roll. Can't do that till you hit the ground, and that could easily get you killed if you're, if it, if it's just. If it's a bad moment or you're caught at the wrong place at the wrong time that's all i wanted to say because i figured out how to recreate the bug so jumping to recap jumping and hitting title your rush key the title crash key should cancel the animation here even tapping it for a split second will make it cue so as soon as you hit the ground you you title crash and then you can attack or use do whatever other action you're trying to do so try not to hit title crash in midair after of using an attack that you i think yeah, the only exception is Ascension because that only links to uh, Thunder. Ascension and Thunder linked together. So what I was doing earlier would have worked if it was a different skill, like uh, what's on? Oh wait, T. So if I was to do, yeah, like it works with any other skill but uh, Ascension because Ascension only links into w one other skill, which is this. Flash canceling has not existed in GMS, and if it did exist at any point it was quickly fixed or bugged again because th the reports i have seen are like three years old or the or two, two to three years old depending on which form thread or which video you're watching uh, without with all that said hopefully this gets fixed i'll be making a form post on the nexon forums to maybe get a response because the other form thread did get a response but it was not fixed so maybe if you bump it, maybe if someone sh shows some amount of support for it other than myself, we can get it fixed because it it is one of the most, it's the biggest complaint I hear about playing a Thunderbreaker. So Thunderbreakers aren't fun to play because when you're bossing, you can't move, which is currently true. You only, you're very limited on your mobility, even though we have a large mobility kit available to us, we just can't use it that effectively in bossing. Thank you for your time, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.